Hey guys, Passive Baller here. We are now on the fourth game uh, for this uh, November 7, 2021 game date for your NBA. This is the game between Milwaukee Bucks and uh, Washington Wizards. And this will happen 6 o'clock p.m. Eastern Time. That will be 7 a.m. Manila. Milwaukee Bucks, uh, they're having a subpar performance of 4 wins and 5 losses. Considering that they are the defending champions, man, that's kind of bad. Now for Washington Wizards, um, I have to admit I'm one of those who did not expect uh, that they would, you know, show this good. Um, actually, uh, as of the moment, they have a record of six wins and three losses. All right. Before we proceed, I'm just inviting everyone who have not subscribed yet to our YouTube account or YouTube channel. Please click on the subscribe button below. At the same time, include that bell logo. That way, automatically, you guys will be receiving notifications whenever there are new videos, or predictions, or anything that will be uploaded. All right. Okay, this one's hard. I have to, you know, I have to admit, because uh, obviously Milwaukee Bucks is the defending champion. They have the, uh, you know, they have Giannis Antetokounmpo, um, an MVP. They they got Drew Holiday back, but still, they're in the struggle. You know, my my New York Knicks actually beat them beat them hard by double digits cons even you know even considering that Milwaukee Bucks already established uh, a lead as much as 21 points and for Milwaukee Bucks for the past five games that they had for the last five games they only won one and that was against Detroit Pistons and man no disrespect to Detroit Pistons but Detroit Pistons is one of the bottom dwellers of the NBA right now now for Washington Wizards they're actually hot. Six wins, three losses. That's what I was saying earlier. I did not expect that they would be this good. Um, when they started losing, I, I was like, ah, this is it. But nah, you know, they came back. And, you know, I kind of like the roster that they have with uh, Montrez, uh, Dinwiddie. And, of course, their leader would still be Beal. You know, but there's a, a lot of people out there who can actually help out and compliment Bradley Beal. Um... Not to mention the fact that uh, Hachimura is not even there yet. You know, he's in the injured list. Uh, a huge boost for Washington Wizards is that Gafford is back. You know, Gafford is back and he actually played well their last game. Uh, that was against Memphis. Um, I checked on the spread. Um, they're still favoring Milwaukee with minus three on this. Um, mind you, Washington is at home. And again, Milwaukee Bucks. It's actually struggling. Anytime Milwaukee Bucks can explode, you know, that's why they are the champion. But it's hard to uh, say no to the Washington Wizards who are actually playing like that, who are at home with the plus three on their names. So my pick of this one would be Washington Wizards plus three. I think in any case, Milwaukee Bucks would win. It wouldn't be that much. So uh, just for safety, I'm going to put um, plus three on Washington Wizards. And again, our pick on this one would be Washington Wizards plus three. Peace out. Pass love and God bless.